Somebody needs to clean up this filthy ass house. We ride together. We die together. Bad boys for life. what's up welcome or welcome back to my channel it's your girl ea sean and we are back with another episode of university days if y'all saw the last episode y'all already know a lot has been going on a lot has been changing but we are officially in our senior year with our main characters and last semester was tough that was a hard semester i don't know how i got out of it but i'm glad to be here chris just came up off of playing a soccer game it's friday night at 9 40 Y'all know he has soccer games every Friday and Saturday, and he won victory. Chris' team delivered a clutch performance and won the soccer game. So Chris is doing his thing on the soccer field. Um, let's just check in with him real quick. So we look at his class schedule. He has one more credit he needs to get. He's holding a B-plus um, GPA in his economics course, and he is taking a class called Time is a Flat Circle. Um, and the skill is for research and debate. And he has not at all even started his work there. And then his playmaker, soccer career. Oh, he stinks. Chris, you stink. Um, has a game tomorrow. So he'll play his game in about 20 hours. And he needs to practice juggling. But so far, so good. So Chris is doing his thing. Now, y'all know in the last episode, we had to get rid of Jaleesa and Jason because they just messed up the vibe in the house. And so they're not in the house anymore. We do still got Keon. He is still here and looking as fine as he has ever looked. This man is getting so fine. I was looking at a um, older video, like the very first episode and he, like when he was a freshman and he was so scrawny and skinny. This man fine now. Oh my God. So Keon is still here and Keon has lots of credits to get. He's on probation. He's really not doing that good in school, but he's taking two courses right now and he's studying biology. And then we roll over to Jabari who, you know, is also, I think Jabari got kicked out of school. Yeah, he got suspended. So he's going to have to wait five days before he can get back into school. Um, and he's kind of struggling in his biology degree too. Um, he has a D plus at the moment. Jabari, I'm trying to do your intro. You going to the bathroom. Okay. Like I said, we did kick out um, Jaleesa and Jason. And so we do have a new house member. And this is Antoine Good. He <laughs> is a freshman. He just came to Brightchester this semester. So while most of the guys in the house are either juniors or seniors, or at least have been on campus for quite a few semesters, Antoine just got here. So Antoine is fresh in his coursework. He wants to study to be um, a professional athlete. Like he is into fitness. So I'm going to go over his somology really quickly. So he is at Brightchester studying biology. He has no credits. He's a freshman. Doesn't have a GPA yet. His first two classes, the first one's for fitness, always be selling. And then he's taking a wellness visual, visualizing wellness course as well. Um, and let's just talk about his somology a little bit because I do like to get to know my Sims. So Antoine is a young adult. His traits are cringe. <laughs> and I don't know if y'all have ever had a cringe sim, but cringe sims are so funny. So he's a sim who who is obnoxiously oblivious and oftentimes met with polarizing reactions. Cringe sims can be socially unaware of their surroundings at times, but have an adorable enthusiasm for life. So he's cringe. Um, he's also a bro. He's active. He has a high metabolism. Um, and he has the um, impression personality Jester and Hero. Um, so, and they're watching a movie right now, so they're kind of <laughs> reacting to stuff. But he's just getting to know the guys in the house, so he doesn't really know them very well. Um, and it looks like he's tired, so I'm gonna go ahead and send him to bed because he's like nodding off. It is 12 o'clock at night. You probably should go to bed, and then we'll work on classwork. Look at him, not him going to sleep on the couch, like. Antoine, I, you have a bed. And Jabari got up so he could sleep. That's so cute. Antoine is sleeping so good. Look at, 
Not him snoring. I can't. I can't. Jabari, what is going on? Okay. Oh, he's going to chat with Kian. He is snoring so loud. So Jabari's buff is pinch of salt and laughter from feeling close with someone nearby. Feeling great. And then looks like he's bored. Boring movie. Nobody to share a smile with from being alone. Oh my God. And their surroundings. I feel like they need to clean up so bad. Chris, not his facial hair growing in. Oh, he's naked. Yeah. His little butt. <laughs> <laughs> but thank God he got up and showered. What? Hold up. What is this desire? Oh, to chat with Trinity. Let's catch up with Trinity. Okay, you can chat with her, but and he wants to attend a party. And you know what? Oh wait, what's going on? Who's arguing? Oh, I thought they was arguing. Like what? Y'all better not. I do think that they should throw a party though. And we'll do it today since it's Saturday. I'm gonna have the boys throw a house party. We haven't had a house party in a while. Let's do it. Friends. Yeah, and we gotta get rid of this. This. Hold on, let me just blick that out. Just, and this too. Like, oh, it's the baby diaper that was fucking with they move. That baby diaper, yeah. And I just, like Antoine, you sleeping on the couch is fucking up the living room. Like, why you didn't get in your bed? Keon was finna get on his computer. So I did rejig like everybody's bed. So I don't know if y'all remember, but Keon, when he moved into the frat house, he did not have a room. So now that Jaleesa and Jason have left, like there's more available space. So he took Jaleesa's old room, which is kind of, you know, girly. We might have to update that for him. But so this is his room, which I feel like he got like the best room in the house because it has a like computer area and it has a bathroom in suite bathroom. And he has his own TV in his room. She had the best room in the house. And then I gave um, Antoine Jason's room, which is on the second level on the same floor as Chris. So he has the bedroom where the tripper pole is. <laughs> So that's his bed. But I feel like they should get a hoops game in. I mean, I don't know if the boys know if, oh, he's gonna talk to Antoine, play football with Antoine. I just don't know if the boys know, um, if the guys know if Antoine can hoop or not. So let's play a game. Let's do a hoops competition with all of the guys. Let's see, let's see if, if Antoine can hoop. I actually don't know if he can. I actually do not know if Antoine can hoop. I have no idea. I haven't played with the sim at all, like not even a little bit. So we finna find out today. It's 2.30 in the morning. They finna have a basketball game. Y'all, Keon just looks so good. I ain't even finna flex. Like, <laughs> he looks so good. <laughs> Damn, Chris face hair, facial hair is here. What do we what do we think? Huh? Let's pause real quick. What do we think about Chris facial hair, y'all? Like Chris usually keeps his like like five o'clock shadow situation, but when his facial hair grows in like this, he looks so grown to me. Like he looks so grown. And if it wasn't for his hair being braided like this, I would be like, this is a daddy, y'all. This is a poppy. Okay, okay, Antoine. All right, let's check out Antoine. Okay, Antoine. All right, he's in shape. He, he's not, he not looking too, too bad himself. <laughs> All right, and then we know Jabari been getting soggy, so we're gonna have to work on baby. He gonna have to do something about that. But I mean, he look okay. But they finna get a little hoop session in. And, Chris is such a flexer. Him hooping in his slides is such a flex. <laughs> He's so flexy. That shit crazy. Okay, Antoine, let's see what you got. Let's see what you... Oh, okay, so Antoine does have... Oh, he got mad that he missed that. Damn, Jabari. Not the brick. Yeah. That's crazy. Okay, Keon, what you got? Let's see what Keon working with. Let's see it. Chris is like, I am surrounded by peon. I'm the only one. He literally, he's hooping in his slides. Like, y'all need to get it together. Let's see, Chris. Can you make this? Of course. Of course he can. Y'all need to practice more. <laughs> I don't know what to tell y'all. Okay, so, okay. This is Antoine's second shot. Let's see if he gonna make it. Antoine. Y'all gotta practice more. I don't know what to tell y'all. But anyway... We're gonna have to get Antoine a little love interest, y'all. Like, all the frat guys be having him. Okay, Jabari. Oh, yeah. All right. Okay, we see you. Yeah. We see you. Let's get it together. We're gonna have to get Antoine a love interest. I mean, technically, Keon needs a love interest too, because technically, Keon's love interest is preoccupied. Who is. Oh, wait, that's Antoine. Hold up. Who is Lauren? Uh -huh. And Lauren, y'all know she is not on the market. So 
Keon don't really like nobody but her, for real. I mean, he was smashing Jaleesa when Jaleesa was in the house, but y'all see what happened with that. Dang, Chris, not from way the fuck over here. That boy is a flexer, y'all. I swear to God. He is such a flexer. He's just such a sexy, flexy ass dude. Okay, Antoine. Okay, Antoine. Okay, with a little dribble, with a little one-two. Oh, okay, so he's not so bad. He's not as bad as we thought he was. That's what's up. So yeah, we're gonna have to work on baby. We're gonna have to get him a little something, something. Mm, yeah, Jabari, you the, you the trash one. Okay. You the trash one. Yeah, it's you. It's you. Uh -huh. All right, so we're gonna let the boys play their game. Okay, so it does appear that that basketball game was much needed because look at Jabari, y'all. He's feeling playful. He is feeling playful from good game, from, <laughs> from losing a basketball competition, win or lose, playing a basketball game was such a close, with such a close score, it's always good fun. Um, and then he was already laughing. But before that, y'all remember, he was bored. Dang, Jabari, where you get a sandwich from? That would look good. Okay, let's go ahead and check to see. Oh, Jabari's not in school. So let's look at Keon. I already know and Keon went to sleep. Keon said, I'm tired. I don't got time for that. I don't got time for it. I know he got a presentation he got to do. Oh, he don't. <laughs> for the first time. What about um, Antoine? Oh, Antoine got a prezzo. Is he watching? Oh. <gasps> Y'all, was Antoine just watching a uh, corn? <laughs> I just caught him watching some freak. You know what? I'm gonna put his presentation out, and I think he should just go ahead and start capturing. I don't want him to get like behind because I already know how it go. And then Chris, I don't think Chris got a prezzo. Nah, he don't. He don't. Look at Chris. So what are we gonna do about Chris' facial hair, y'all? What are we gonna do? Because if we like it, I'm gonna keep it. But I kind of like it when he has his hair low. Like, I ain't gonna lie. Oh, let's look at his buffs. Let's see. He is feeling court royalty from winning a basketball competition. Christopher has emerged victorious with what a game. Chris is always winning, y'all. He That's all he do. All he do. He play every sport, beat everybody ass and everything. Like, he's he's just a winner, winner chicken dinner. That's truly what it is and i'm gonna have chris relax in the sauna oh relax in the nude let's do it in the nude i think that the nude is good jabari i mean he's not in school this semester so he's really not a focus oh but you know what you could do is you could actually clean up the house i am so tired of this house looking like the way it looks like somebody somebody needs to clean up this filthy ass house like they just be living in filth Let's see what the bathrooms are looking like. Let's go over to the bathrooms real quick and see what they looking like. Okay, the bathrooms seem to be okay for the moment. He's washing that dish, which is good. Oh, it's neighborhood brawl. Okay. Okay, maybe we do something there. Um, Make loan payment. No, we ain't paying none of these loans. I don't care what nobody said. How you hurt your finger? That don't make sense. <laughs> It don't make sense. Okay, it's nothing else to really clean up. Okay, I'm gonna have Jabari work out because I feel like he needs to work out. I'm gonna have him work out and then I'm gonna have um, Antoine work out with him. Oh, he's oh he's tired. Antoine, never mind. Go to bed. We have been up all night playing basketball, so we'll let you sleep. We'll work on that presentation uh, later. Uh, oh, the door is locked. Hold up. I mean, um, he's so tired. All right, and then Chris is doing his homework. Cash Charles, wanna buy pills. He in here, look, Keon asleep, and Chris is in here doing his homework. I swear to God, Chris and Keon, men relationships are always so funny to me because they're literally connected at the hip. And I don't know if people notice this, like if y'all watch the series, like Chris, Keon are like really connected at the hip. Like they, like they're bros for life. Like they have, they've been bros since high school. But it's so weird because you don't really see them like really giving affection to each other. But they do little stuff like this. Like Keon is asleep. Chris is in the room doing his homework near him. Uh, Keon will take naps in Chris's bed. Like, <laughs> I mean, Keon wants to share the same girl that Chris is sleeping with. <laughs> okay, Chris is about to um, sign. I love like the in the nude features. But like, yeah, he about to, he about to sauna and relax and then we'll have Chris Don't juggle. Oh, he should sad. eat. Is there food in the refrigerator? Let's see, cause otherwise we are gonna order a pizza. Y'all know that's all they eat around here is pizza. Is it leftover? Oh no, let's get Canadian bacon. That sounds good. Okay, what is he uncomfortable about? Oh, sweating profusely. He has to pee and he's hungry. Okay, so Chris, real quick. Before you eat your pizza, come down here and pee and then take a slice. 
and then I'll have you take a shower. Okay, who's up? Who is that talking? Jabari? Jabari, did you work out? Oh, he did. You still looking soggy. Nah, nah, we need to work a little harder. Here we go. No computer for you. What was he gonna do, watch porn? You are off this semester. I'm gonna get you into your best physical shape. And I'm gonna get Jabari back on the team because Chris is a senior and Brychester, they need some players. Like, I'm trying to get Antoine on the team, um, and we're gonna work on that too. And then Keon need to get his ass on this team. Keon still ain't got on the team. He ain't even tried. Oh, it's a debate showdown. We should probably go. After the guys, <laughs> after Chris Pease, I'm gonna take him up there. And to further confirm how close, like, Chris and Keon are. Keon is up in here, y'all, taking a shower. And look where Chris and Jabari are in the bathroom while Chris or while Keon is taking a shower. Like, it's so funny. I just think it's so cute. Okay, so I'm gonna travel. Lauren talking about some I heard you became friends with Jabari he's pretty cool first off little Miss Lauren Power how you know Jabari cool that's what Chris would say that's what Chris was I think Chris is skeptical about Lauren because he done popped up several times when Lauren was out trying to get to know Keon I think I think he's skeptical oh wait what why is Devin here y'all this is Chris dad <laughs> this is Devin Dyson if y'all don't know this is Devin this is his dad um pops what's up like what do you want so if y'all don't know which I don't think I have ever like told the backstory Chris and his family or whatever but Chris grew up with, oh, there goes Lauren. Wow, okay, well, hey Lauren. Chris grew up in a single parent household with his dad and his brother, who y'all know is Grant. Basically, Chris didn't have a good life. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Like his upbringing, like when he was young and when he was a, a kid, like a child and a teenager, like his dad was just on fuck shit. Grant moved out way early. Like he left the house and left Chris with his dad. His dad was just on BS. Their mom pretty much abandoned them. So for the most part, like, all he had was his dad and Chris moved out of his dad's house at 16. So Chris had, has been on his own for quite a while. And like, I don't necessarily think he has beef with his dad. It's just like his dad isn't like his role model. Like he looks up to his brother more than he looks up to his dad. Why is Lauren dazed? And from what? Lauren, what? Fingering dazed from becoming dazed. Lauren is still dazed. Their head will clear up soon. But from what, Lauren? So I switched over to... Lauren, um, she is at the student center too. Um, mostly I wanted to, we know we have to like advance Lauren. Um, and so she needs to tutor. So we're going to do some tutoring. She doesn't have class for two days. So we have time for that. So Chris is about to play his soccer game. Hmm. Oh, he left. Is everybody leaving? Is it because the game is about to start soon? The game is about to start soon. And then they're gonna be doing the um, pep rally in a little bit too. So if we can't talk to Chris, it looks like Chris is leaving. If he's gonna go home, cool. We'll go ahead and get our tutoring in and then we're gonna have Lauren, cause she is on the, the spirit squad. Girl, you look so dazed. I mean, is Keon gonna stay or they're all leaving? Oh wait, Keon's gonna stay. Oh no, he left too, okay. So let's go ahead and get our tutor session in, try to get it in before the game starts. So let's just tutor 
on, I don't know, let's tutor on Charisma. It takes five hours to tutor, so it's two. By the time it's seven, it should be cool. Well, oh, it will end in one hour. Ain't nobody in this debate. Or, oh, I guess people are in the debate. But ain't nobody paying attention to it. Nobody care about debate. And it's funny because Brightchester is a big debate school, but I guess this class is just like not into debate. Okay, so Chris did come back to campus, and I think he came back because his game is about to start soon. Um, and the pep rally is popping. They already just popped up at five. Uh, I want Lauren to be done with this tutoring so she can come over here and do the pep rally. Okay, so we are officially out of tutoring. Um, Lauren is not <sighs> feeling comfortable. Let me see if she has some chill pills with her. So let's take a chill pill. Um, we'll do our homework later. We got stuff to do. So let's pop that. All right, so let's just see who is out here. Who is this? So I guess we missed the pep rally because everybody kind of like dipped. But I feel like Lauren should fight. <laughs> she should brawl. Oh, wait. Yeah, this is the Foxberry mascot. Can we do it? Can we brawl with him? Oh, look who it is. It's Jason, y'all. Oh, let's talk to Jason. He came back. He's technically... You know, honestly, yeah. I don't even remember yeah. if they're still enrolled. But Jason is here. I don't know who she is. Let's meet her. And I think the game is rolling right now. Yeah, the game is up. Wait, hold on. It says meaningful stories focus inertia. With meaningful stories, Sims stay focused for longer when they are using their mental skills. As Lauren is not challenging her mind right now, she's losing her focus. Okay, whatever. Anywho. Oh, University Mixer Night. A Mixer Night event is starting at the Campus Commons venue. University isn't at, oh wait, isn't all about rivals. Sometimes enemies can be friends. Stop by for an evening of camaraderies and frater fraternization between the students and staff for both Foxbury and Brightchester. Where is it? University Mixer Night. Where though? I don't see that. I don't see no University Mixer. Is that where Chris was going? Cause well, no, Chris is at his game. That's where Chris is. He's at his, there is in no way. I don't know where they would. It says stop university at the campus common venue. So here, are we here? Cause ain't nobody over here. Nah, it's messing me up because where is the mixer? <laughs> I want to go. I want to go to the mixer. Okay. Let's just see how, like, let's let it play out. Let's see what happens. I want to brawl. Okay, so everybody's going to the game. So let's go. Let's go to the soccer game. Chris is playing. So excited. But where is this university mixer? I don't see it. Sims, don't play with me. Where y'all having the university mixer at? And how come we can't see it? Okay, Lauren is going into the game. Alright. They're all going in. Let's go, Bride Chester. Let's go. I want to go to the game. <laughs> like, I want to be at the game. But, wait, who's out here? Oh, is that Orange? Orange, come into the game. Like, what are you doing? Not this bike. Is Orange still in high school? Orange should have graduated with us. Okay, who's over here? Wow. Wow. I hope Rochester won. Oh, wait. Let's see. You, she want to do this homework so bad. How do we get to the mixer? It says the common, but like, is it here? Oh, it's here. Shumba Smurgs. Um, oh. hold up. Hold up. Okay, so Jaleesa's here. Chris is here. Did he just blow a kiss at her? No, no. Over here now, Lauren. Report to, report. Now, run, run. Because what we not about to do is that. I'm going to fight Jaleesa. Oh, 
Drop your bows. How he get out the game so fast? Chris looking hella grown these days. There go Lauren. I can see her in the window. Nah, get over here now, Lauren. Get over here, girl. Get over here. ASAP or tree. ASAP or tree. Let's go. Cause nah. What was that? Okay, hold on. Cause it looked like something was said. Hold on. Hold on. Let's embrace him. Let's let's um physical intimacy. Let's embrace. What did he get mad about? Oh wait, okay, wait. So this is the little mixer, cause look. Keon up in here with his gear on. The mascot is right here. Um, I'm finna ask what her problem is. Um, <clears throat> we're gonna do a rude introduction. Lexi, does it do about? Wait, what's the sentiment that pops up? First impression, immature. Sentiments about Jalisa. She thinks she's immature. Girl, I see you flirted with my man. So let's fight her. <laughs> Look at Chris walking away. He said, let me get out the way. Lauren, you bet not lose. You bet not lose. No, nah, but Jaleesa is in shape, though. Oh, I'm worried. Lauren got her Louboutins on, too. Like, girl. Oh, she got her. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not a hug after. Oh, okay. Chris over here, like, whatever. Let's, um. Oh, wait. Are we getting food? Oh, we are getting food. Okay. I wanted to talk to Keon. Oh, he's doing his homework. Not Chris over here playing soccer. You just got through playing soccer. Oh, they got the keg too. They got the keg. This is a cool little mixer. They out here playing chess. This is actually a cool mixer. I like it. Let's talk to Keon. Let's complain about classes. I know he better not. I know him and Jalisa are cool, but he better fucking not. It's them like, I don't like this. I don't like this. Lauren is trying to start a chant, a Rochester chant. That's the one with the mascot. Oh. oh wait, did we get first impressions from them? Jason's first impression of Lauren is that he is crushing on her. And that he thinks that she's interesting. And she thinks that Jason is responsible. Ah! And then her first impression of Pania, Lauren thinks that she's egocentric. But she thinks that Lauren is imaginative, interesting, and she's crushing on her too. Lauren got the hose. Ah! Woofa! Ah! 
<laughs> Wait, it says Lauren is now a member of the Brightchester Spirit Squad. She has been given official birth. I thought we was already in the Spirit Squad. Like, what? We been doing Spirit Squad stuff. What the fuck is you saying? We been on the squad. <laughs> oh, is the mixer over? <laughs> the mixer must be over. Okay, so we're having a party at the fresh side. Keon in here cooking. I hope you don't burn nothing down. Please, Keon. Please don't burn nothing down, sir. Oh, God. All right. So people are kind of trickling in. Not Chris eating. Okay. So we invited a whole bunch of girls, y'all. Like, we invited a whole bunch of just randos. So I'm going to have Chris just. Oh, she's a teen. Oh, she's too young. She's too young. I think um, Morgan is a teen, too. Oh, no, she's not. I think she's. Ooh. I can't say, honestly, that Chris don't have no white girl, though. So maybe we get my little white girl. Oh, is Nova's here. Yeah, 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 yeah. I invited Nova. That's right. Um, sir. You did not come up in here butt booty ass naked. No, you did not. We invited Jason. He's over, he's right there. Let's talk to Nova. Let's call her over. Oh, not Antoine got the hose already. Antoine. Antoine got the hose already. We just started the party. Yeah, let's let's introduce ourselves to all of them. Yeah. yeah. Oh, All right, so where is Nova? I think he called her over. Did she come? And she was like, nah, I'm good. Oh, she's over here. Oh, we have Chris knows Nova. Okay, let's get some drinks. Who's the bartender? Is he the bar? He's not the bartender. Who is the DJ? Let's get the DJ in here. I don't know if I hired a DJ. Let's hire a DJ. Let's get a DJ. I know I hired a bartender. Oh, and I didn't. Okay, let's hire one of those. Oh, Mike came. Let's see if we can get some drugs from Mike. Uh, borrow. Drugs. Uh, buy drugs. We're just gonna get some weed from him. We need to get some pills though off of him. But we'll get some. Um, do he have papers? Does Chris have papers? Okay, so I am having Chris talk to Mike. Mike looks upset. I don't know about what, but I'm gonna get some weed from Mike. Mike, oh, his life's so bad. All right, let's just get some. Let's get some sour diesel. That should be enough. We'll get a sip of sour diesel. And then, what do you say, sure? What do you want? I got it. All right. And then we're gonna roll up. And then who's in the kitchen? Who's in here? Ain't want to strip naked and make each other feel good? Yeah, go for it. <laughs> Um, Tahiti and Jabari about to get their freak off. Oh, they, they right here with it. I hope they don't do it in the kitchen. Please don't do it in the kitchen. Please don't do it in the kitchen. Keon, where you at? Where's Keon? Okay, cool. Keon, can you come in here and get the bottles rolling? Everybody hungry. Oh, y'all such college students. Y'all hungry as hell. Who is that in the bathtub? Is that Mike? Mike got in our bathtub. I can't. Look at Amira looking like a stripper. Okay. So we're gonna buy alcohol. We'll buy some, um, ooh, that's expensive. I don't even know if the boys got it like that, but we'll, we'll do that, okay. All right. So they did get a bottle of Hennessy. Oh, uh, uh, bruh. <laughs> Go into a room. Oh my god, they're so bad. They are so bad. Okay, where is Chris? Chris is with the DJ. Okay. Okay, Chris is about to smoke. 
I'm gonna have him smoke. Apologaba Crezzo. Hey, ask her to play. Wait, damn! You see her grubby? She tearing that fool up. Not Chris in the kitchen with it. And Grace it right here like, bro, what you want? Oh my God. Okay, what about Kinley? I was thinking about who could Chris fuck with next. I think he should try to, let's try Kinley. Let's, let's do a flirty intro with Kinley. Oh, Nova is right here. I really want him to talk to Nova, but Nova not giving him the time of day, so. Let's see what's going on upstairs. DeAndre, why are you in our bathroom? It's so many people at this party, yo, like. I don't even know what to say. I'm gonna put some of the um, nugs by the uh, bong. That way people wanna smoke, they can. Where's Chris? Oh, he's talking to Sarah. Is he flirty with Sarah? <laughs> Him and Sarah were, were cool as hell in high school. All right, let's call people to the Hennessy bottle. Not Tahitia might be pregnant. No, it just said that he used a condom. Man, it's so many people in the frat house right now. It's crazy. <gasps> Not her panties are on the floor. You, I know you fucking lying. I know you lying. Her, y'all, her drawers, her panties are on the front porch. Oh my God. My Sims are so unhinged. They're so unfucking for real. It's crazy. Okay, where is Chris? He blow. He's so high. Grayson, who told you to cook? You better not start no fire in my house, bro. Y'all better not start no fucking fires in my house. I'm gonna be mad. I'm gonna be mad. Did y'all hop on the bottle yet or what? Oh my God, everybody came up in here. Let's clean this up because I don't want no problems. Let's clean, let's clean up. Where is um, Antoine? Antoine, can help come, help clean up. Oh, ain't no trash can. That's right. I didn't never know. I didn't never know trash. I'm gonna have them just grab a drink. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Just grab a drink. Jabari, Jabari, you was just getting cheeks. You was just getting cheeks. Okay, who's upstairs? It's not getting nobody in our rooms. Was nothing crazy. It's early in the morning, y'all. Like, it's 7 o'clock in the morning. But the party's still rolling, so we're going to keep it going. Oh, they can't get uh, yeah, to stuff. Uh, Brugie, can you? Uh, uh, you Wait, who is he feeling flirty about? No. Let's see if we can smoke this bong together. I've been wanting to do that. Oh, you can't. Damn you. Girl, what are you doing? Coming in my bathroom. Alright, are people upstairs? Oh, somebody hooping. Oh, Mike is hooping and I forget her name. Kelly. They up here hooping. Okay, Mike. Mike not looking too bad these days. He just look angry. Oh my God. What is going on? Hey, ain't know where to put it. <laughs> Alright, let's get some pizza. It's one, please come help clean up the kitchen. Jabari, Jabari done went to sleep. Keon can help. Look at all these people in his house, child. I mean, people, I mean, I'm gonna I'm release the people. I'm gonna release them. Cause, hold on, where'd he go? Are you in the bathroom? Oh no, he's here. Eating his pizza. Actions, this man group. <laughs> Wait, what's the problem? Oh, he probably be inappropriate with him. Okay, Keon is cleaning up. Let's go ahead and dead the party. Let's dead it. It's two. It's nine o'clock in the morning, yo. 
We did start late, but still, we're gonna try again. We're gonna try again. Oh, everybody had a good time. Dang, look at all these plates. Look at all these plates Keon got. Look at that. Oh, yeah. All right, let's let people pal out. Okay, so it is literally only a few hours or like an hour after they finish hosting that party. And look, Kayla go text them. Hey, cutie, hope you're having a good day. I know the sorority house saw that party from next door. I know it. It's no way. Go to the bathroom, Chris. Okay. So Sarah is still here. Miss Sarah, you look very cute in this little outfit i'm really confused as to why you haven't bagged nobody and i feel like you over here looking at antoine like what's up with the new guy so i'm gonna have antoine talk to oh not him already being flirty crush nearby who Ugh. antoine you got a crush already you wasn't gonna tell me hold on let me see who he crushing on is it sarah oh he is he is crushing on Sarah. <laughs> he thinks Sarah is um, an interesting sim. And Sarah thinks that Antoine is impressed. She's impressed about him and his uh, first impression is that he is funny. Y'all know that Antoine is uh, cringy. So that's maybe what she's picking up on, on the funny. Because he is not a funny sim. But he is a cringy one. Tell worst puns imaginable. Oh my god. Let's have him... Uh, Talk about the sunny weather. I feel like that's something Antoine would say. <laughs> and of course, Jabari is here eating us. Oh. Okay, let's tell her a dramatic story. <laughs> and then I'm gonna compliment her appearance and see how she reacts to that. Sit here and talk to me. Cause fuck Jabari. Who is this at the door? Jabar, do you know him? Hold on. You're not gonna greet him? You're gonna stand right? And then you got sweat on your face. And you know what that sweat is from? Yeah, last night. Let, um, let's do a respectful intro. And then, Jabari, you need to go wash your ass, mister. Got sweat all over his body. Where is it, hygiene? Okay. All right. Keon is taking a nap. Okay, hold up. Keon and Chris are taking naps. And this is adorable. This is what I mean by like they such BFFs. They always sleeping together, like in the same room at the same time. Like, please tell me y'all see this. <laughs> they always also be doing the exact same shit. I'm sorry. They are really like synced up. It's like they twinning or whatever. Okay, Antoine getting a text message from who? Citra? Citra. I'm in the mood for some retail therapy. You want to go to the flea market with me? Antoine, you got the hose already? Yeah, let's go. But let's bring Sarah with us. I mean, the semester hasn't started. I think it's Sunday. We're going to go out for a little Sunday fun day. And the boys are asleep. Y'all saw them napping. Antoine only one that's for real up like that. So let's just go do something. No. Oh, hold on. We just got here. Oh, my God. Lloyd and Valentine are having some. It's them. It's them right here. Are we serious? Are we are we actually serious? Okay, so Antoine is here with Sarah, and I think this is Citra. And him and Citra are cool, but he's not crushing on Citra. He's crushing on Sarah. So I'm gonna put them in the same group just so they just stay together. Oh, they're, okay, we're already in a group, <laughs> of course. And we need to haggle the vendors. Did Jabari come? Oh, not that that was Jabari. Who else is here? Let's see. I think this is Tab. Oh, Fabiana, Yuna, Elena Shackleford. I keep seeing her. Summer, Savannah. This is Savannah and Anaya. Wait, and this is Emmy. Okay. Antoine's kind of cute. Antoine is actually kind of cute. Fleurs, oh. So. Okay, let's see their first impressions. It says, hold on. It says that. Antoine's first impression is that Trayvon is strong minded and Trayvon's first impression or sentiment about Antoine is that he's reasonable and he's interesting. Oh, everybody actually likes Antoine. That's kind of sweet. That's kind of sweet. I was kind of I wanted I wanted to add like another menace to 
the frat house, but I was also like, we just got rid of two real wild ass sims. Like, I need something a little bit more chill. But anyway, he needs to haggle with the vendor. So let's just kind of, let's do his cringy stuff. Let's spout memes. Let's see if Trayvon likes that. Sick of foods. Balafoy Pollock. Mm, mm -mm. It's Emery. We got to talk to Emery. We got to talk to Emery. Antoine, Jim we can talk to Emery. She looked too good. Charfin, Yaskib, Yefka Bomzoi, Sistu. Wait, what is this? Kish double agul, but up. Oh, he's spouting memes. Batanaba Andrew. Muska yo Andrew. Chasapa Axina. Squaya. Look at Trayvon. Oh, he thought it was kind of funny. Okay. Okay. Oh, you had a boo. Okay, let's haggle, bro. He said no. Oh, he said yeah. Okay, you can have twenty five percent now. Let's get something. Let's get a lamp. Let's get this one. This one looks cool. Oh. For pasta trofa. She walked right up on him. We don't even know Fabiana. Y'all saw that? She walked right up on Antoine. Oh, oh, it's one you got a fan. Let's talk to her. Let's do an enchanted introduction. Let's see if that work out. Uh huh. All right, let's see what's popping on. Okay, so Antoine, first impression of Fabiana is fun to be around, and then Fabiana is crushing on Antoine. I knew it. I knew it. There, she walked right into Antoine's face, y'all. She walked right up on him. Right, I mean, like, she walked up on baby, like, in his face. Like, she didn't even know him. They weren't even acquainted. That's crazy. Okay, so Antoine is getting sleepy, but I think he's going to be able to thug it out. Um, That's, like, his only, like, bad need. But he also just got, I think, some reputation, some positive reputation. So, okay, Antoine, I see you. The people like Antoine, and I think that's adorable. Um, I think, oh, look, it's Mike. Do we think Antoine does drugs? Antoine, do you do drugs? Or is he a good boy? I don't know. Let's talk to, should we meet Savannah? Let's meet Savannah. Let's do something funny with her. Let's do cheerful. So <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> Is that this Moochie Peachy? Benji? Fosinoy, Valpim. Then who is she? We'll meet her soon. Aha! Debu Klebo. Sister Whip. Okay, let's see. Hold on. Savannah said that. Oh, Antoine <laughs> has a crush on Savannah. Wow. Antoine, you're a little whore, love. You're a little bit whorish. Um. And he thinks she's interesting. And Savannah feels like he's impressed. She's impressed and he's reasonable. And then for DeAndre, he felt like um, that DeAndre was funny. And that DeAndre thought he... DeAndre is impressed in, in things. Um, Antoine is interesting. Everybody thinks he's interesting. That's good. Yeah. Okay, let's talk to Emery. Let's ask her for a selfie. Okay, and then... Ayaka, Ayaka. Oh my God! They both think each other is annoying. He thinks she is so basic looking. <laughs> I mean, she she is kind of basic looking, but damn. Oh, he's gonna get a selfie with her. Ah, oh, that's so cute. That's cute. Oh, she's doing his <laughs> autograph for him. He's so excited. I told you Antoine got the juice. He really got the juice. He a little juicy one. Chris Chris finally got somebody in the house that's on his level. That makes sense. Alright, what else is what going on here? I hope those people are done having whatever they were doing. Y'all, look, it is panties on the floor. That, the, these, that's panties. 
That's a thong on the floor in the bar. That's what's going on right now. Okay, so it's so I'm talking to DeAndre. I don't know. It's Sunday at two. I feel, <gasps> y'all. Where DeAndre? Not DeAndre. Where did Antoine get a? Did he have this from the party? He got a glass of cognac in his inventory from the party, y'all. Oh my god. <laughs> That is hilarious. It's two o'clock on a Sunday. That means we're going to go turn up. Okay, y'all. So, for context, it is the Student Athlete Awards Day. And if y'all remember, every year they have, every semester they have the Student Athletes Awards ceremony right after the semester. And um, the mayor hosts the award show. Well, he's taking the athletes out for brunch today as like a celebration for that so y'all know and look y'all chris is below he is higher than the eclipse okay like baby is below blizzy like what is life what what are eyeballs is what he said shit like on on the moon in the clouds what is you saying <laughs> anyway they're gonna go to um brunch with everybody they're getting the table that they want i don't know how okay let's read let's read antoine's buff real quick so because i just like i'm gonna do this gameplay from antoine's perspective mostly because i know that the girl that he invited the two girls he invited one he's crushing on and then the other one is crushing on him so i just feel like this is gonna be a really interesting dynamic but his buffs right now are one, he's happy from Brush With Fame. He is happy from Celebrity Autograph. This is from when he saw Emery. Happy from another celebrity sighting. Happy from Liked Sim Nearby. He's also happy from a, having a happy moment from a true happy moodlet. He's playful from Still Got It from Cringe Sim Simply Holding a Conversation because he's silly. And then he is tired. He's been tired all day, though. So, yeah. So, he's going to sit down. Um, we're here with jabari i believe chris is here yeah all of the housemates are here and fabiana and sarah are both here which is cool i actually want chris to talk to sarah because they haven't talked in a while and fabiana is new to the squad so that'll be interesting but i'm getting everybody hennessy it's about to be an expensive bill but oh well and then i'm gonna get egg rolls for fabiana i'm gonna get <laughs> I'm gonna get weed pizza for Chris and for Sarah. I'm gonna get pepperoni for um, Antoine, and I'm gonna get pasta primavera for Jabari and Keon. I think Jabari and Keon are so tired of pizza. They're like, we be eating pizza every day. I'm tired. <laughs> Okay, so then I'm going to have Antoine talk to Fabiana. Um, I'm just having him say, like, what's up? Like, what's going on with you? Let's discuss interest. <laughs> Look, he got his Hennessy cup still. Antoine's going to be drunk, y'all. Okay, so then I'm going to have Chris talk to Sarah. I'm going to ask him to do something funny. Oh, Jabari already talking to him. Oh, who's calling Antoine? Let's see. Oh, Citra. Hey, Antoine, I've been thinking about getting to know Cyrus. Girl, to be honest, I'm not sure. Girl, go get to know him. Okay, Keon, you talk to Jabari for me. Something funny. Let's talk about hobbies. Okay, so then Antoine and Fabiana. I think he should ask her if she's single. I know she like him. And then Chris is talking to Sarah. He should say, oh, Fabiana is married. See, good to know. Let's gossip about family drama. Um, Jabari, talk to Keon. Say something funny story. Tell funny story. Yes, our food is here. Yes, we all got the hen. We pizza. Look, look how happy they got the food showed up. That's me and my friend group for sure. For sure. Bob Saini, 
Bro. I know they was hungry though. I know Chris so, is hungry for just sure. Punk is Lanaga. Garabu broke fresh. <laughs> Eat weed pizza. Keanu, Keon grubbing. He was hungry too. Okay, Chris. There you go. That weed piece look kind of good, low key. Fabiana's just chilling. She's married, but she likes Antoine. Her, with her being married, gotta do anything. Okay, so I'm gonna have him talk to Sarah. I'm gonna have him flirt with Sarah. I'm gonna have him compliment her appearance. Who was in here? Okay, nobody. Ibarra? Oh, she. Now look, I'm not trying to be funny because I know Antoine does also like Sarah, but I feel like Chris knows Sarah longer, so I feel like he would shoot his shot because he know Antoine trying to shoot his shot. If that makes sense, I'm gonna have him talk to Sarah. Let's um, say something friendly. And then Keon and Jabari, who are you talking to? Nobody. I talk to Fabiana. They have only gelato sorbet ice cream. Okay, so let's get the first three. We'll get the Strasatella? Strasatella gelato? Yeah, I don't know how to say that. And then I'm going to get the butter pecan ice cream for the last three. Hey, Finn Quofi. Newlets Bacorbinet. Y'all finish these drinks. They asked Christopher to be a sitcom star rank five. Oh my God, Chris, you could be an actor at rank five. Yo, he's in college. He, if he accepts his job, he can't finish college. He has one semester. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. <laughs> that sucks. Cause that's a good deal for him. He doesn't have a job y'all. Like rank five as an actor is a good deal, but he he has one semester left. He can't. Yo, oh, this is a treat. Not Miss Jordan Power popping up. She must have came with Maya. Oh, we're blessed. Chris knows her too. He could talk to her. No, cause I had what's to call it. Introduce us, Lauren. Dang, Jordan, you too, you too exclusive. My girl is a global superstar. Like, it's hard to talk to sis. Okay, fine. Look how high Chris is. <laughs> okay, his buffs say that he's very flirty. He is edibly high. The legendary drink is drunk. And steamy text. He got a text from who? You got a steamy text from who, Christopher? Boy, you know who he needs to text? He needs to text Desiree. I don't forgot he was with that girl. I know she is over there like, I can't believe. I can't believe he's not talking to me. He got to send her a text message. I know she's she tripping. The last time he seen her, he hit her in public. He ain't even been nowhere in private with her. I know she is freaked out. See, look, I still hit her up. She said, I see you are in a good mood. Maybe we should head out. Salty Pond Saloon. Nah, I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm doing something right now, but another time. Oh, what y'all getting up for? Oh, they finna go play football. But he high and he drunk. How you gonna play football? They both high. Look how he walking. <laughs> She high too. That weed pizza. Okay, Antoine, did we get our food? No. He's doing his homework. Confess attraction. You're going to tell her you attracted? Oh, Antoine is bold, y'all. He is a bold one. Wait, did she flirt with Jabari? Y'all, what is going on? Where's our food? <laughs> Chris came back. Hey, you want to get lucky with me? <gasps> Sarah as Keon. Tenebib. In a hot second, Keon will be like, hell yeah. Uh -huh. What, the way, what? Uh-oh, uh-oh. And like, but you know what? I'm not that surprised. They all went to high school together. They did, they all went to high school together. But Chris was flirting with Sarah. 
And Antoine was flirting with sis. And she in the bathroom with Keon. When new. Okay. <laughs> okay. Kira. Look. Sombra. Not him pillow talking. What they talking about? Wow. I'm just oh. like, okay, am I surprised? <laughs> oh, am I surprised Sarah wanted Keon? Keon is fine. Like, wait till she see him with his shirt off.